here now with Ty Lopez. He is the co-founder of Retail E-Commerce Ventures, which has been buying distressed, well-known brick-and-mortar brands to turn them into hopefully successful e-retail businesses. And I looked, and there was this notification saying, you have one new sale for $39. You just sold a Chicago Skyline. It was a very surreal feeling, and I've been chasing that high ever since. Pier 1 Imports is closing nearly half of its stores as it struggles to draw consumers and compete online. The home goods retailer has been struggling for years against rising pressure from online competitors. Bought Pier 1 Imports, bought Dress Barn. Modell Sporting Goods, Steinmark, Linens and Things, Franklin Mint, large brands with huge brand awareness, and we bought the intellectual property, made the move to transform them into e-commerce brands. No one likes to go to Walmart, so might as well ship to your house. software engineering as I was doing this job and it's just been so lucrative so far. There were internet sales by 79%. That is one of the biggest numbers I've ever heard of in my entire retail career of 30 years. So I'm already on Amazon, I already sell on Etsy, I already sell on eBay, I already sell on Shopify, I already sell on ClickFunnels. Barely keep up with demand. Followed by death. 